It's time for Dodger baseball. This series can't get any better. Daytime baseball here on MLB Network. It's the home opener of this new season between the Minnesota Twins and the Milwaukee Brewers. Two great hitters lead their teams to battle next on MLB Network. Here's Byron Buxton now. And we are ready for some daytime Leading baseball. The Twins, center fielder number 25. Byron Buxton. And we get things started here with a check swing, but he holds up in time. Ball one. Harold Reynolds, these Brewers, as they begin play here this afternoon, they come in hoping to get back on the beam as they've dropped three straight. Yeah, this is one of those losing streaks, but you know what? I, I, I'm a little more cavalier about it than they probably are, but all they got to do, really, this is a good team. Uh, one sack as that ball is into the gap in right center. Should be good for at least two bases. And he's looking for three right out of the gates today. And he is out at third. And that's a big mistake there leading off the inning. Here's Brian Dozier now. He comes in with 16 home runs on the season so far. And a good pitch on the inside corner for strike one. One. 
bases are empty, one man out. A great job of changing okay. speeds there. It's 0-2. The shift will be of little importance here as this is lifted in the air out to left field. And Braun will handle this one for round number two. Ready now, Miguel Sano. He's hitting in the 270s on the season coming into this one. The fastball here is he'll take a look at ball one, one and oh. The windup and the 1 0 pitch. And he jumps at a changeup, a swing and a miss. Well, that was a good changeup right there. You see how he swung through that ball? Man, he's got him thinking now because that was clearly an indication he was looking fastball and got fooled. And that's high and off the plate, two and one. And that's in there. So perhaps some life here with two men out. So the two out base hit and the top of the inning is still alive. Now at the plate, Kenny's Vargas coming into this one. He's carrying a rather substantial batting average up in the 330s. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. And there's one well above the zone for a ball. 1-0 count. Here it is. Now a check swing, but it's strike one anyway, says the home plate umpire. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. And the changeup just missed the inside corner. He's set, and the 2 1 pitch. Liner toward right center. But he will run this one down in right center. A tough L9, and the inning is over. In is Christian Yelich. It lead things off here in the bottom Leading half of the first. Forward. Center fielder. Christian Yelich. And this ball's going to find the seats down the left field line. Foul strike one. Harold, these twins, as they take the field here this afternoon, they come in riding a five-game winning streak, and they've really got things clicking. Inside Look out. Forward. They're starting to put it together. When you get to this territory and you start moving into a week of solid baseball, that's a club starting to come together. And I'm looking at one right now. Up high. Two and one now. Into the windup. Here's the two and one pitch. Zero. A wave and a miss. A tick behind a good fastball. He couldn't quite catch up to that one. He needs to get his foot down and see the fastball out of his hand. Three now an off speed pitch back. well inside and it forces him to bounce away from danger. This one smoked the other way. High and deep to left. Nearly a big fly to start the inning instead of foul ball. And he takes ball four. So the leadoff man is on here in the home half of the first in a scoreless ball game. In now is Lorenzo Kane. First chance for him here with a man on following the leadoff walk. But gloved by the third baseman for the out. And he will scurry back to first as he'll think twice about trying to move up. Into the box now. Number seven. First swings for him in this one with a runner still at first and one gone. First pitch on its way. And a neck high fastball that time. On the ground near home. That winds up foul. Runners on first with one down. And he lays off the pitch down and away. Ball two. Set to deliver on two and one. Ball three. Pass ball taken high, and it's three and one now. Seems like he's really having a tough time finding that rhythm right here in the first inning. He walked a guy. Now he's falling behind this hitter. He better figure it out. Quick. Hit on the ground down the first baseline. He's set, and the payoff pitch. This is on the ground over to first, and that's through for a hit. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. Batting fourth. Now time is called here as we'll get a trip to the mound. Travis. 
Travis Shaw comes on with one gone here as he looks at a called strike one. That's a nice job of getting ahead right there. This is a tough situation he's in. He's going to have to use all his pitches to get out of this jam. A lot of movement that time. It's 0-2. And drilled right back up the middle. And that's through into center field. Base hit. Yelich rounds the corner and is headed home. And they're not going to get him. He's in there at the plate. Here's Ryan Braun now. The average for him entering play, not far north of 200. Now some action out in the Minnesota pen as it looks like both a lefty and a right-hander are up to throw. He's set. Here it comes. And a slider bounces, and that gets away. Oh, one's the count. So now two men in scoring position. Second and third here, one man out. And this ball is heading for the seats down the right side as the count will move to 0-2 now. Working for the punch out and the offering. And this is swung on and missed on a good pitch and Braun is gone for route number two. Stepping in, Stephen Vogt hitting just a bit over the Mendoza line on the year. In there for strike one, 0 oh and 1. Matt, this is how you want to start a game. First inning, you already jump on them early. You get one run in, and now you have two other runners on base. You come up with a big hit here. You can really make a big dip right here in this game in the first inning. He's got a chance to ring up back-to-back case -back here, and that would be huge in this situation. And here's a ball hit in the air. Next pitch will be number 24 in this long first inning. A swing and a miss on a ball way outside the strike zone. And the now to the plate, Chris Colabello. He'll lead Leading it off, off here Minnesota. to begin the second. Left fielder, Chris Colabello. Went about Aye. halfway there, but it's a called strike regardless. The wind up and the 0 1. A good pitch there on 0 1 as this is hit fouled over to the right side. Strike two now. The wind up and the 0 2 pitch. Lifted in the air out to right. Kane is under it. One down. So coming to the plate, Eddie Rosario. Hitting a little over 250 coming into action in this one. He's ready. Here's the first offering. And he lays off there, 1-0. The windup and the 1-0 pitch. Knee-high slider that he takes a look at. One out, nobody on. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. To two and two now. So, he threw the slider darting away to him two times in a row. Now, I don't think he'll go for it again. I'm looking for something hard inside on this pitch. Look out. Don't want to hit him there. It's full three and two. Ground ball right side. The tag, and he is out. Digging in the switch hitter, Eduardo Escobar. He enters this one sitting right on the Mendoza line at an even 200. Slider, oh look out as that one just about took his nose off. Bases are empty here with two men out. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. That one is out of here. This game is tied. Into the box, number 23. The average for him entering play sits down in the 250s. Here's a looping fly ball out to right. And that's in there. Base hit. So striding in, Urban Santana. As he'll get his first opportunity in this one. Urban Santana. First delivery to him on the way. Swing and a ball lifted in the air toward the line in right. Kane is there and he'll make the catch to retire the side. Stepping into the box, Orlando Arcia. He'll start us out here in the home the half of the second. Orlando Arcia. Into the windup and the pitch. 
Uh, he had to be looking for something else to start the at bat. It's 0 and 1. The wind up and the 0 1. Swing and he pops him up over toward foul territory. And this is going to wind up a foul ball. This is just great pitching. They start him off with the slider to get the strike, and then they bust him in with a fastball. I don't know what he's thinking up there, but they really are messing with his mind right now. So he racks up the swinging strikeout on the breaking ball. Orlando Arcia is dealt with for the first out in the bottom of the inning. Into the windup, here comes the 0-1. Swing and a miss just behind a lively fastball. This lineup is flailing right now. They're having a hard time just making contact, let alone putting the ball in play. Ball, Change up, and he ain't buying it. One and two. Here he comes on a ball and two strikes. A dive. He's got it to first. He is out. So digging in now, Wade Miley. He'll get to take his first cuts here. Swing and a miss on the slider, nothing in one. Oh, and he's really getting the better of him now. It's strike two. He's not messing around this inning. He's attacking the zone. He's showing lots of confidence. He's 0-2 on this hitter after having two quick outs. Nice job. And that is in there for a two-out base knock. So the two-out hit will bring Christian Yelich in this inning. Striding in once again, Christian Yelich. No official at bat for him, but he has scored a run in this one. First offering on its way. Liner towards second. In there, a base hit. So now they'll have runners on the corners with two away. Ready for another chance. Lorenzo Kane looking for a third straight two-out hit in a run in the inning. here as he steps off to looking back at first. First pitch of the at bat. Swing and a liner. But foul. Runners at the corners. Two men out. And a check swing. Did he go around? No, says the first base umpire. It's ball one. Took something off there as this pitch is in the dirt, but handled quickly behind the plate. He's set, and the 2-1 pitch. Swung on and missed. Outclassed by that fastball for a strike. From the belt, the pitch. And this is going to be fouled into the diamond level seats. Oh, that's one he's going to want back right there. A fastball right in your wheelhouse, and it fouled it. And another foul ball. Chop fouled over towards the coaching box. He's set. Here's the 2 2. And the changeup is way low that time. Full count with two outs now. So if he could put the ball in the gap somewhere, he could have a good shot of driving in a run because the run at first will be in motion. In the air, out to right. On the move is Rosario. He's there to track it down, and that'll end the inning. Digging in for his second at bat, Byron Buxton. He'll stand in to open things Center up fielder. here in the third. Byron Buxton. And he chased up and out of the zone, a swing and a miss. Now, that low 90s fastball, it won't overpower a lot of guys. But if it's mixed in well, it's a real effective pitch. High in the air out to center field. Yelich is under it, and that's the first out of the inning. Digging in to try it again. Brian Dozier, 0 for 1 here in the early going.
first pitch of the at bat on its way. Swing and a ball hit on the ground, but this is foul for the first strike. Here's the 0 1. And 1 and 1 as this one's in on the hands. And a ball popped foul to the right side out of play. Oh, that looked like a pretty good pitch to hit. It's a little bit late, so he might have been just fooled just a tad bit, just enough not to square it up. And now a check swing, and he went around, says the home plate umpire. No appeal needed, and there are two away. Here comes the first pitch. Miguel Sano is at the plate now as he looks at strike one. That's a ball. Here's one that misses high. It's one and one. Ready to deal. Here's the one one. And now a slider in on the hands and he's lucky that one didn't come and get him. You know what I'm seeing here is a reluctance to throw the fastball. It's like he feels he can't throw the ball right by him right now. And that'll get down for a two out single. Striding into the now box. Batting. Kenny's Vargas. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Here comes the first pitch. Sends that one out of play for strike one. Well, that was a big two out single we just saw, and for pretty obvious reasons. The inning went from totally under control to now. He's got to deal with some dangerous hitters here with a runner on base, and this is how two out rallies start. He's ready. Here's the 0 2 pitch. Slider whiffed on for strike three. Matt Moore is going to come on to pitch here, and in just the third inning, you have to think he'll be asked to eat some innings. Now at the plate, number seven. He singled his last time up. Now a swing and a ball chopped foul right at home. Play. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. Changeup gets him out in front for strike two. Into the windup, here comes the 0 2 pitch. Pulled toward right center field. Rosario is there. And he hauls it in for the first out of the inning. Coming to the plate now, Travis Shaw looking to follow up the RBI single from his first at bat. Curveball, and that misses in the dirt for ball one. Checks his swing, but this pitch is right there for strike one. There's two pitches in a row, Matt, that were away. If this is any indication how he's going to pitch in the rest of that bat, he's saying, you're going to beat me the other way. Nothing inside for him to pull. If you want to hit it, take it the other way. And a fastball blew it right by him, and there are two down. So two away in the Brewers' half of the third. And that'll bring forth the great slugging left fielder, Ryan Braun. Oh, and he gripped that one a bit too tightly as it broke down and just about got him. Out of play off to the right. It's one and one. Ooh, that was a good pitch to hit. He wants that one back. He was just a little bit late on it. Oh, he pulls the string on the circle change. One, one and two. Two strikes. Nope. To two balls and two strikes right now. now. Two and two. And an off-speed pitch swung on and missed, and with that, the side is retired. Stepping in and ready for another shot, Hitting Chris Colabello comes Not into this at bat 0 for Chris 1 in the ball game. Colabello. Swing and a miss as he was way in front of that one. Matt, it looks like he was sitting there getting ready to jump on the first pitch fastball, and they pulled the string on him and threw him a changeup and just got him out front. Now I don't know what he's thinking up there at the plate or what he might be looking for. He could be pretty confused right now. Skied into straightaway right. Kane is under it. One out. Now in the box, Eddie Rosario. Right He's 0 for Eddie 1 thus far. Rosario. And a ball 1 and 0. 
the 1 0 delivery. And that finds some outfield grass. It's a base hit. Stepping up now, Eduardo Escobar. He went deep in his first at bat. We'll see what he's got in store for us here. First pitch of the at bat on its way. A slider that just grabs the outside corner. Well, look out. That slider almost hit him. And that ball's not intentional. That was a, not even a fastball. Relax. Relax now, people. I know we get excited when the ball's up and in. Hey. Fastball called strike. One and two. Now a swing and a ball popped high in the air over toward foul ground. And this is going to wind up a foul ball. Here's another one, too. And look out. He has to back away there and then give a little glare out to the mound. It's ball two. He went deep earlier, so that might have been a little bit of a message they were trying to send to get him off the plate. At the very least, they're clearly trying to get him from getting his arms extended again. So striding forward no now, number, number 23. 23. He reached on a single in his first try. First pitch on its way. Hit in the air out to straightaway left. Braun will drift over to his right a few steps as he takes it for the second out. Now at the plate, uh, Matt Minnesota. Moore. Two men on, two away Matt here in the fourth. Moore. Here's the first pitch to him. Swing and a miss way behind the big fastball. Good lead off a second there. Now the pitch. Fastball called for strike two. Two quick strikes and now the 0-2. Oh, and he goes up the ladder on him, but he lays off one and two. Oh, this is where you have to be really aggressive. One and two count on an American League pitcher that rarely bats. Go right after him. And a fastball called strike three and the side is retired. Digging in now, Stephen Vogt. He'll start Big things out with Matt Moore as we get the inning underway. Number Into the windup and the pitch. In tight here with the first pitch fastball that's 1 0. Into his windup, here comes the 1 0. That's lifted the other way out to left. Colabello, a range to his left as he tracks this one down in left center for the first down. Next to bat, Orlando Garcia. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. And he throws the fastball by him here. 0 and 1. Good arm action on the circle. Change swung on and missed. 0 and 2. The wind up and the 0 2 pitch. A little bouncer. And he'll reach first as they can't make the play on him. Coming to the plate now, the Jonathan Villar. Five. He's Second 0 for baseman. 1 after grounding out Jonathan. in his only trip to the plate so far. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Pitch swung on and hit in the air. Buxton is after it. He makes the running play. Two down. And he will scurry back to first as he'll think twice about trying to move up. At the plate, Wade Miley. One for one after a single his first time up. Miley. He's ready. Here's the first offering. And that changeup makes him jump, a swing and a miss. Well, this is an interesting scenario, Matt. I think with the pitcher at the plate here on two outs, you're probably not going to see him steal because if he gets thrown out, then you got the pitcher leading off the inning. Take a chance, see if he can hit a ball in the gap. And we'll have to leave it there as the play is made here to end the inning. Digging in once again, Byron Buxton. One for two with, with a double on his line Another thus far. 25. Dribbled up the line, Buxton. but it's foul. Strike one. Into the windup. Here comes the 0-1. This is flared out towards second, and this will be put away easily for the out. Ready once again. Brian Dozier, 0 for two on the afternoon so far. Fastball too high to start him out here, 1-0. and 
Dozier waiting on the 1 0. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Kane is under it. And that's the second out of the inning. Here's Miguel Sano. Two base hits, both singles to this point. First pitch hacking here, and that's the first strike. Really feels like he's just on cruise control out there on the mound right now. Yeah, it really does, Matt, but this offense isn't helping him too much. It sort of feels like the next team to score is going to win this thing. Now here's the pitch. And an off-speed pitch swung on and missed, and with that, the side is... In is Christian Yelich. He'll start things out here in a Leading tie ball Brewers. game. Center fielder, Christian. Zero. Swung on and missed for the first strike. He may have to get his eyes checked on that one, because if he's looking for fastball, man, he had no chance catching up to that. He better check his eyes. He's really late. Swing and a miss, and he's in the hole 0-2 now. A chance here for Dozier at second. Throws in time, and that's out number one. In now is Lorenzo Cain. He's 0 for 2 thus far in this one. And he misses inside with that one. Ball one. One run, five hits, and no errors on the Milwaukee line score so far. And he falls behind now, 2-0. That softly hit to right. Will that get down? Vargas ranging into shallow right, and he brings it in for the second out of the inning. Now batting. Ready for another seven. shot now. Number seven. One for two on his line so far in the game. Just does manage to get a piece there as this is bounced foul. The windup and the 0 1. Another one fouled off, and he's quickly behind 0 2. Back to back changeups and he fouled that one off right there. I don't think he's going to come back with the third one. I got to be thinking some oh, other pitch yeah. is coming. That misses one and two. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the one two. And this is going to find the crowd down the left field line. Count holds at one and two. That's probably not what he wants to do with two strikes right there. With the three. And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Leading Kenny's Vargas. He's First 0 for baseman. 2 with a strikeout Kenny in this one. Vargas. And the first one pitch oh. of the inning here misses down and in for a ball. It's 1 and 0. Oh. Now the pitch. Zero. Big swing and a miss at the changeup. A ball and a strike. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. Just a bit high that time as he misses for a ball. He's obviously been very impressive on the mound in this one. And I think the big reason why is his ability to stay out of the middle of the zone. That's kind of obvious, but it's clear to me that even when he misses his spots, he's not missing over the plate. Throw to first gets him, so the leadoff man's retired here to begin the sixth. Colobello. Digging in once again, Chris Colobello. No hits in two trips to the plate for him in the ball game. And this is hit hard to nope, the right side. Foul. Ball, Tries to shave line. the corner with that pitch, but it's one and one. Inside Good with ball. the slider, and that'll back him up a bit. Set to deliver on two and one. And I believe they'll say he broke the plane as yes, he did. It's ruled a strike. The pitch. And this is swung out and missed, so it's two up, two down to start the sixth inning. Digging in and looking for more, Eddie Rosario. He's one for two in the ball game. And that's inside for a ball, one and oh. Into his windup, here comes the 1 0. And a change up here, but that's taken low in the dirt for a ball. Well, not a great spot to be in right now. 2 and 0 to a great hitter like this. This is when you really have to pay attention as a pitcher. And if you have good off speed stuff, this might be the time to start mixing in your off speed stuff. You chased a bad ball up out of the zone, 2 and 2. He's looking really great on the bump right now. I mean, it's been a while since he's allowed a base runner. Got him looking, and that'll do it. The inning is over. And 
And that brings up the left-handed hitting Travis Shaw. A hit in two Third tries baseman. so far. Travis Shaw. First Count pitch of the inning misses here to the cleanup man. It's 1-0. Right here, he's looking to get himself into a good hitter's count so he can take a rip and maybe give his team the lead. He certainly has the power. Colabello is over toward the line a bit as he takes it for the first out. Here's Ryan Braun now. 0 for 2 with a couple of strikeouts for him so far. Now a swing and a fly ball. And he will make the play out there, and there are two away now. Now Ready for another Patrick. chance. Stephen Vogt, 0 for 2 here to start the afternoon. Now a ball grounded foul over toward the coaching box. One run, five hits, and no errors on the Milwaukee line score so far. Here's a late swing and a miss, strike two. And he misses there, one and two. Now Moore with a one-two. And an off-speed pitch swung on and missed, and with that, the side is... Eduardo Escobar standing in. He's off to a bad start in this one. Two for two, including a home run. High and tight here to begin the inning. It's ball one. Now here's the pitch. Out of play off to the right. It's one and one. And here's a ball hit in the air. Vogt is under it. He's got it one away. Now Digging in to try it again. Number 23. number 23. He singled in two trips to the plate thus far. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Here's a swing and a high pop-up. Number seven is there for it. Two gone. Stepping up to the plate, Matt Moore comes Matt into this at bat Moore. 0 for 1 in the ball game. And ball this is one, off no the play. corner and low ball 1. Sneaks a fastball by him at the letters it's 1 and 1. The difference maker in this outing than others is the two seamer. He's doing whatever he wants to do with that ball. It's moving all over the place. 1 and 2 now. Looking to punch him out again the pitch. Swing and a liner. Throw in the dirt, but a good scoop at first saves an error as the side is retired. Striding in once again, Orlando Arcia. One for two on his line so far in the game. Orlando Arcia. Tap down the line. Foul ball, however, strike one. Started to go around there, but he holds up ball one. Ready to deal. Here's the 1-1. One, one. And here's a ball hit in the air. Vargas backs up a bit, and he takes charge for the first out. Digging in the switch hitter, Jonathan Villar. It's been an 0-for-2 effort for him to this point. And he'll just get a piece here as this is chopped foul at home plate. Got him to go after that one, and he's in a quick hold, 0-2. Into the windup, here comes the 0-2 pitch. Swing and a miss on the fastball that time, out number two. Ready for another shot now, Wade Miley. He's one for two in the ball game. And that swung on and missed for strike one. The windup and the 0-1. A wave and a miss, a tick behind a good fastball. Just getting blown away so far. No reason to throw anything else to speed up his bat. Just stay right there. Changes up on him, but that's in the dirt for a ball. Ready on one and two. Breaking ball swung on in the dirt. Number 23 corrals it. And the throw to first ends the inning. Here's Byron Buxton now. He'll start Getting things out for us here in inning number eight. Into the windup and the pitch. 
committed to that one a bit too soon as it locks him up for strike one. Boy, not a good swing there. That was really ugly. Anytime you can make a hitter look like that, you've done something special. Uh, did it look to you like he was guessing on the pitch? Oh, certainly it had to be, Matt. But if he was, he obviously wasn't looking for that pitch. And this is pulled foul as he was way out in front there. Set to deal on a ball and two strikes. Now a check swing, and he went around, says the home plate umpire. Tough ruling, but it's out number one. Number two, second baseman, Brian Dozier. Brian Dozier stands in as he checks his swing here for strike one. The wind up and the 0-1. One and one. That's in time. Ready with the 1-1 one -one pitch. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. Kane sprinting after it, but this will land foul shy of the wall. The one and two pitch. And he'll try to hold back, but he won't be able to as that's rolled a swing, and there are two away now. Here's Miguel Sano. First two men in the inning have both gone down via the punch out, so we'll see if he can fare any better. Swing, and he pops him up over toward foul territory. Number seven is there, and the side is ready now. Christian Yelich. He'll see what he can do leading off the home eight. Center fielder. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Started to go around, but it's ruled strike one anyway. When you're facing this good a hitter, man, that strike one becomes so important to get ahead with him and make him think about something else. Now you can control that bat. From the windup, the 1-1 one -one pitch. Swing and a miss way behind the big fastball. Now Moore with a 1-2. Checked his swing there, and did he go? No, he did not, says the third base umpire. Ball two. Into the windup. Here comes the 2-2 pitch. This is on the ground over the first. Vargas takes it in, and he'll take it to the bag himself for the out. In now is Lorenzo Cain. It was a fly out for him in his last trip. Into the windup, and the pitch. Grounder down the line at third. Uh, this gets foul. It's 0-1. Into the windup. Here comes the 0-1. Liner toward right center. That gets down, and he's got himself a base hit. Ready once again. Number seven. He'll look to bounce back after Domingo Santana will come out to pinch hit here in a big spot. And he swings through a fastball and doesn't catch up with it. It's 0 and 1. And you see that average below the dreaded Mendoza line. Before the delivery, a check on that go-ahead run at first. And yeah, we see a lefty and a right-hander start to loosen up in the bullpen. Here's the 0-1 pitch. Hot shot on the ground is short. One there. Relay to first in time. And just like that, this side is retired. At the plate. First baseman number 19, Kenny's Vargas. Ninth hey. inning underway now as the first pitch is taken for a cold strike. Well, Matt, we're talking about first pitch strike, right? Look, it's not great what he's been doing, but he's over 60% of the time. First pitch is going to be a strike. That's a nice little nugget to have for the starting pitcher. He's feeling it out there on the mound, just getting the ball and throwing it with a lot of confidence right now. Swing and a flare hit toward right. Kane is in a few steps as he takes it for the first down. How about him? At the plate, Chris Colabello. No hits in three tries so far. He struck out once. 
Good off-speed pitch. Had him out in front for strike one. Boy, he swung right through that on that changeup. The changeup is a tough pitch to swing at for the first pitch because you haven't measured his velocity yet. So you don't know what you're going to see coming their direction. And there's his first base hit in this one. Stepping into the box, right Eddie Rosario. There's one away. Eddie the runner at first represents Rosario. the potential go-ahead score. Double play is in order, however. Swings through the slider there. The 0-1. And he'll try to hold back the swing, but he'll do so unsuccessfully as that's ruled a strike. From the belt, the pitch. Good job to spoil that one away, and he stays alive. That was a tough pitch to spoil right there. A two-strike changeup on the corner. Tough pitch to foul off. Inside and high with that one. One ball, two strikes. Now the one and two pitch. That misses, and we're even at two and two. And it's late his afternoon of work, and the longer this at bat goes, the better chance of him making a mistake. But as a guy starts to tire, they're more likely to leave the ball up. But man, he's been good so far. And with that, the go ahead runs up to second now with only one away. He homered earlier and his two. Matt Albert takes over on the mound in a tie ball game. There is one gone here in the top of inning number nine. They're too high that time with the slider to start the at bat. It's ball one. Number 16, Domingo. The 1 0. Foul toward the third base dugout, but this will get back into the seats out of play. The 1 and 1 pitch. And there's a pitch that just misses the inside corner. Well, I know the last thing he wants to do is load the bases right here. So the pressure is on right now to get back in the strike zone. And he pulled up in time, but it's a cold strike two. Here's the 2-2 pitch. There's a swing and a missile sent out to center field. It's out of here, and they've taken the lead in the ninth. Santa Maria. Into the box, number 23. He's working on a one for three thus far. Jason Castro will come on now as the pinch hitter. Here's a slider to start things out, but it misses by a few inches or so. It's ball one, and he's a guy looking to break out in a big way. Hasn't been getting the results he or his club have been hoping for. It's never advantageous to fall behind 2-0 as a pitcher, but if you're going to do it, it's far better to do it with a guy down in the bottom of the order. Time for a challenge fastball right here, though. The set and the 2-1 and one pitch. Gets on top of one here and chops it foul right at home plate. Set to deal on two and two. Now a half swing, but it's strike three anyway, says the home plate umpire. And that's out number two. Up next for so striding forward Mitchell. now, Matt Mash. Moore. Your 0 for two please. on his line thus far. Joey Gallo Moore. will get the number call 13. here as he'll hit for the pitcher. Joey Gallo. Drops in a strike to start the at bat. Nothing in one. He comes in with that average down in the 240s. 13 home runs and 32 driven in. Oh, got him a swing out of his shoes on that one. Nothing in two. The 0 2 delivery. And this is fouled back and out of play. Three runs already home here. Swing and a high pop up back onto the outfield grass now. Shaw onto the grass, and that retires the side. Duke is the man called on to close this one and earn a save in the night. And that brings up the left. Leading off for the Brewers here in the bottom of the ninth. Third baseman. And he'll look at a first pitch curveball that's in the dirt. It's ball one. Now the pitch. 
hit down the line at first. But a foul ball, one and one. Set. Here comes the 1-1. One, one. Swing and a miss on a nice biting slider. Well, that slider right there, that's what makes him tough against the left hand. That pitch is almost impossible to hit. Squared that one up just a little late. Here's the one and two delivery. Swing and a miss, and that'll get a groan from the home supporters here. One away. Here's Brian Braun now. 0 for 3 with a couple of strikeouts for him to this point in the ballgame. And the slider is low and inside as he just about got him there. Ball two. The last thing you want to do when you've got a three-run lead in the ninth is give the other guys any sense of hope. It's a good time to challenge here on 2-0, especially since there's a good chance he's taking until he gets a strike. I like that pitch right there. You know he's keyholing it too. Oh, and you put one right on the corner. He's not going to swing at it. And now all of a sudden you're back in the count again. Well, that's a pretty well-known fact that your batting average goes up as you get into more. There's a swing and a drive hit well out to right field. Rosario ranging back. And just short of a home run. This ball's off he's the in. wall. Not in time. And he's in there with a double. Now. Now to the plate, Stephen Vogt. And he's got to get on base. Manny Pena will get a chance with a runner in scoring position here. It's a pinch hit now with one away. Liner towards second. Oh, got him, and that's a gorgeous play. Next to bat, Orlando Garcia. And he needs to make something happen. They're down to their final out here in the ninth. There's a ball ripped toward the gap in left center. And that'll score the run from third. And don't look now, but the lead's cut to two here. And he'll make it in there with a two-out double. So coming to the plate, Jonathan Villar. He struck out swinging in his last trip to the plate. And a slider gets away from him here as it just about got him in the ankle. You know, in this situation, you almost have to pitch like there's no one on base. That run really doesn't mean anything with the lead they've got. The hitter is the guy that can turn this game on its head. Two outs here with a runner at third. Now a check swing, but he does manage to hold up in time. Ball three. Time to narrow your focus up there at the plate. In a one-run game, he doesn't want to walk it, so there's a good chance he's going to get something to handle right here. Comes with a slider, 3-0, and but gets it over for strike one. Here's the 3-1. Now a swing and a fly ball. Rosario on the move. Full extension, but he can't make the catch. That's strike one. And he chased it in the dirt. Castro has it. Throw on to first here is going to do it. And the Twins make it six straight victories now as this one is over.